sounds like fun. Raiders roll. Oh my god, guys. Hello! Uh, sorry, my mic was muted. Good thing I checked OBS there. So anyways, welcome back to the, uh, the, the Orange You Glad Bro. I was explaining that, uh, we were trying to get a quadruple fire there. And uh, I made some, uh, I made some adjustments because, you know, Storm is kind of like fire. And fire is just, well, it's fire. Uh, but we got Aura twice, which is going to be great because we're going to have a lot of range. Um, because I think a few of you guys wanted me to do some fire Alarax. I'm going to see if I can get it. Uh, but yeah, I was actually, I had my mic off because I was recording some spoopy sound effects for my, uh, for my spooky games, uh, not spooky games, uh, spooky, uh, what is it? It's my, it's my spooky channel, my spooky channel. I have a, I have a channel that I'm going to be telling spooky stories on, and then so, uh, I, I'm like, I need to record some nice sound effects What's for it, plan? and so I have my mic off. So yeah, anyways, <laughs> let's, uh, let's call in some, uh, prismatic alignments, boys. So, um... These bad boys have 8 range. If I give them a few Havocs, they're going to have even more range. We're against the Manx, gonna, by the looks of it, a Rainer. Because those things sieged up real fast. I am against the Haka, though. Hmm, I feel like I feel like a better idea might be to go Vanguards, actually. Uh, mm, You know what? We'll, we'll, have, we'll have these bad boys out here for now. And then... And then we'll... we'll uh, can I get my Havoc out just in time? There we go. I was like, I gotta concentrate. I gotta, I gotta blink back. Brain power processing. Oh, we, we lost one of our guys. Okay, so it's just myself and Rainer here. Uh, well, that's okay. That's okay. A okay. Uh, because we're gonna have 10 range Void Rays here. Oh, yeah, baby. Get that 10 range Void Ray, baby. 10 range Void Rays, boys. Those marines are, are... Do they have extra health here? Oh my god, they have armor, health, and range. Ooh, what a beauty. Uh, but 10 range void rays are pretty good, so... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I guess we're gonna we're gonna stick with them here. Uh, Rainer's super thick boys are gonna be pushing up here. Shielding everybody else. We got the bounce here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let's What's get... The uh, man, the void rays are so expensive, bro. 275. But I think it's fine, they do bonus to armor, and everything Manx has on the ground here is armor. Does he have extra health or something? He doesn't have extra health. Does he have extra armor? Oh, he does. He has 8 armor. Okay, well, that's fine. I got a bunch of Void Rays here. They're gonna beam him down real quick. Uh, let's put that down over here. And I can get some, like, I can get Telekinesis here, so Alarak can, uh... Because there's one Primal Host? Oh, boys. That's not good. My Void Rays are gonna go down pretty quick, though. Uh... But their bounces, the their bounces are gonna still be pretty lethal here. All right, but it's looking like uh, well, it's looking like we're not gonna have the. Uh... All right, what is up, you beautiful people? At the beginning of this video, but you know what? It's fine. It's good that I checked because now we actually have audio. Because before we wouldn't even have audio at all. Uh, looks like there's some creeper hosts coming in, so that is going to be pretty spicy here. Creeper hosts are generally a bad idea. Not a bad idea. Like they're just a bad thing for the people who are about to get creeper host. Um. Okay, my Void Rays are too busy hitting the Primal Worm. It's got armor, so it's going to take forever. He's, he's doing his best, boys. He's doing his best. He's doing his best, boys. He's just... Oh, my God. What's the plan? <sighs> oh, man. All right. Uh, I feel like with the Energy Regen, Ascendance might not be too bad of an idea, too. Uh, but we'll have to see here. Uh, just because Ascendance are a bit more pricier. I hope Rainer uh, scans here so we can like actually kill all the things. There we go, so we don't like. I don't know. I'm not. I don't need tier three. I just need more weapons. I need more weapons. There we go. There we go. Burn that base. Burn it, boys. I should get a Wrathwalker or something like that. Rainer's not scanning here. This is bad. 
Um, I hope Raina realizes that. Otherwise, he's gonna have a bad time. Ah! Uh, <sighs> Here we go. It's fine. We'll just uh, we'll just have to annihilate everything with our our max range void race. He's still tier one. Oh my god! He needs tier two. Oh my god! Bruh! You got at least tier two, so you can get the tier two weapons, boys. Tier two weapons are good. What's up? Um, but yeah, there we go. Okay, he's got Aerial Burst Sacks for me, which is good, because Aerial Burst Sacks doesn't do splash damage in the air. If it did, it'd actually be the most broken thing ever. Uh, I'm just gonna increase my, my upgrades here, I need to get more weapons. So Reyna's just basically just gonna cost this uh, part of the game here. We could have ended the game if he if he would scan for his waves, basically. Oh, I think I think there he goes. He's finally got something out. No, no, that's the enemy rainer. No, that's the enemy rainer, boys. There we go. My void rays will just tear things apart here. But, uh, there we go. Come on, bounce. Oh, but they're getting stunned. The Emperor's Shadow is gonna be pretty good against me because uh, I'm just gonna get constantly stunned over and over again here. Um, uh, do I want? I'm gonna get some tier three here. There we go. Destroy that Aegis Guard over there. There's somebody here with a Labyrinth Cloak. Gotta get out of there. There we go. I just want those two or three upgrades here so I can like burn through those units here. Like Rainer's units are gonna start dying to uh, the, the Dahaka Splash here. He's finally tier two. Is he gonna scan here? And he's gonna do it? No, no, okay, it's not gonna happen then. Okay, nice move. Uh, oh, there it is. That's why you should scan, boys. There we go. He's got a lot of tanks, but the good thing for me is Tanks do not shoot down. I mean, I mean, do not shoot up. My void rays are just liquidating here. There we go. Let's get our void ray there. Come on, boys. Plus three attack damage void rays. I'm gonna increase bloodshot resonance. Let's keep going. I think my void rays can end this here. I just gotta make sure uh, the Emperor's shadows go down, um, and then we'll be fine. He has eight armor. Oh, he has plus five armor. Okay, well that makes a lot of sense. That's actually really good against the void rays. <laughs> If it's not an armored unit, the Void Rays don't do any damage to it. But I, do, I still do quite a bit of damage here. He's got that Refraction here. Alarak is on the crack. There we go. And there it is, boys. Look at that electricity. Woo! Alright, well that wasn't quite like fire all the way, but I feel like I feel like double fire and double double force is probably a good idea. Just because if you if you don't have the extra range, it kinda doesn't hit the same. Uh, but yeah, there we go, 26k. Alright, well, let's do another round. Alright, we're back, let's do it. This time, uh, I've also normalized my volume. I don't know if the first game was a little louder, because I set my OBS recording, I usually set it, like, to be a little bit more quiet compared to the actual game. Uh, just so you guys don't, like, get your eardrums blown up, and you guys also can't hear me. Uh, but yeah, because I was recording some sound effects, um, I had to make sure that the sound effects were, like, immaculate, so I had to make them really loud, and... Oh, there's Shadow. Okay, I'm gonna take Shadow, boys. We're, we might just go do some Shadow stuff. We might do something shady here. Shadow Force. Okay, I, I think Force is just generally like good if you don't know what to pick here. Fire. I'm gonna take Fire. We got another Dahaka again. Let me make sure Dahaka does not attack me very fast. There we go. And then, oh, we got Fire again. We got Double Fire Shadow. I think I think with Fire, I think Double Fire is really good. But then like you, you should always get something to like help you out. Like like be a little steroid. Like Shadow is a great steroid. Like, cause the attack speed is insane, and then like the 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 the, 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 the words words uh, the, the 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 range increase from force is pretty good too. I'm against the Haka again. Um, I don't know. Should I just go for Void Rays? Don't benefit from the Shadow though. I think this time I kind of want to just go for Vanguards, but Vanguards are very vulnerable to uh, Creeper hosts if the Haka has them, cause the Creeper hosts are the are gonna splash the crap out of me. Um, Let's see, does this thing have extra range? Oh, it's got some more increased attack speed too. Uh, unfortunately, I only got one of them. What does Nova have on her Marines? She's got plus one armor and uh, nothing else, it seems. We got another Alarak. Oh, that's my Alarak. Oh, wait, is my team not putting... Okay. Okay. I'm like, wait, that's me. I'm like, wait, that's me. Okay, what does he have for uh, his stuff? He doesn't have any extra armor. He doesn't have any extra anything. Well, I'm just gonna... Just gonna I'm just gonna chop, chop... There we go, knock him back, boom, boom. I think I'm gonna die here. 
Yeah, I'm gonna die here. There we go, it's okay. Down a Havoc. I could actually, you know what, get Slayers. Slayers attack twice, right? Hold on, let me see. They don't attack twice. My disappointment is immeasurable. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. I could just get some vanguards for the fun of it. Uh, this guy really just say locus at all? Uh, oh, he's probably just like, yeah, dude. And there's gonna be Abathur locus coming in, so you should probably watch out. I'm gonna poking module here. Attack weakness. There we go. Come on, Alarak. You got this. It's just Nova. Puny Nova. Easy. Easy. Boom. 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 Come on. Detect weakness. Detect weakness. Oh, okay. Break it down. I should really put down some of the pressure here. We got some Tempest coming out here. If anything, if there's Tempest, I'm gonna I'm gonna do the same thing we did last time. We're gonna do some Void Race here. Because uh, I feel like Ground Alarak is nice, but you know what could be nicer? Air Alarak with the Void Rays. Because uh, there's also Karax, so like, I don't know. Like, the Hawk Karax and Nova can dominate ground units. Uh, so I feel like playing into their hands not that great. Even though I do have Shadow, Shadow is... It does benefit the Void Rays, but not as, not really that greatly. And I think the Void Ray Splash should be pretty good on these Marines. They don't really have any extra armor, so that's good. Um... And uh, Nova's Marine, Nova's gonna get shredded by these locusts here because they're just gonna be constantly coming out of the ground unless that happens. Uh, okay, Nova's gonna get electrocuted here. There we go. There we go. Okay, we're slowly cutting through them. Oh, there it is. There's the creeper host. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, Nova's Nova's actually pretty good against me. Like if she builds just Marines, uh, and we got our our Tannis building. Uh, Tempest enjoyment with only extra armor. That is not good. I think I think with Tempest you want attack speed. Tempest with attack speed is crazy. But the extra armor is ironically gonna be pretty good against the uh, the uh, Mirage here because it's gonna take technically no damage. It's got eight armor. In fact, he has blood, so he's actually healing from the Mirages. Oh yes, these are not laser beams that do damage. These are reconstruction beams. That's how they repair units, you know. Uh, they shoot them with the reconstruction beam. There we go. Um, but yeah, if Nova's gonna commit to the ground here, like eventually we're gonna be able to overwhelm him. Oh, he has attack speed. I would not get attack speed on Marines, boys. Cause my my units do splash here, and Nova's just like he's gonna get splashed down. That's just that's just how it's gonna be. Oh, there's nothing here stealthed. Okay, I thought there was something stealthed here. Uh, the Haka does he have extra armor? Cause if he if he has only cooldown, it's not gonna cut it. Uh, oh yeah, baby. I guess we got the double fire dream. We did get the double fire dream. We, we didn't get the quadruple fire dream, but I feel like that's a ridiculous high roll. Uh, let's see, what do the mirages have? He only has attack speed? Oh, he has armor on his mirages. That's going to be a pain. Because uh, my void rays only do bonus damage to non-armored. I guess the armor cancels out my bonus damage perfectly. <laughs> I guess it cancels it out perfectly. But my splash here is going to be pretty big. The refraction here, 1.5 up to 4. Let's get another one of these bad boys here. There we go. Um, so I have six of them right now, because the rest of these units are Alarak. The extra armor on the Tempest actually are ridiculously good. You know what, I'm going to take it back here. Like, they have nine armor, so they're actually going to take one damage or something from the Marines. Um, unless Nova upgrades her Marines uh, DPS. That, that Ultralis just got evaporated, thanks to the fact that it is armored. Um, the Marines taking a while to get tickled down though, so that is a little unfortunate. Well, that's okay. We're tickling everyone down in turn. I think the Haka has blood. He's got some. He's bleeding somewhere. Uh, I'm slowly tickling his mirages though. They're slowly being tickled down. I mean, they're still splash. You know, mirages lose to the splash. Uh, but currently they have. Too much armor for me. If he la if he maxes up, he'll have eight armor on those bad boys. Uh, I only have eight armor, so it's like like I can go plus two more. I have nine attack, so I'll do five damage to them. You know those mirages might actually kick my butt. Uh, we'll have to see here. We do have some locusts here, uh, but there's also a significant lack of detection. Uh huh. Let's see if uh, does he have attack attack air units? He does. Okay, well, that's good. 
There we go. Oh my god, you can see how fast the Ultralis melt, though. Like, anything that's armored just evaporates. Um, come on. I get some War Prisms, maybe? <laughs> I don't think War Prisms attack fast enough to warrant me uh, getting them, though. That's the thing. Oh my god, that's so many creepers. This game looks like we're gonna have a fight on our hands here. There we go, let's get some more. I mean, but that means we're gonna have a nice long game here. The Tempests are, are gonna smash through these Mirages, no problem. The only problem is uh, the Mirages are stalling really well for the Creeper Hosts. Um, yeah, the Creeper Hosts are gonna be a problem. Okay. Okay. I think it's about time we get a third gas, actually. It's been a bit of a... It's been a bit of a... A little standstill in the middle here. Maybe, maybe I could get a Mothership. Is that a good idea? I mean, Mothership's attack six times, right? So... This is... 24 extra damage on my Mothership. Uh, there is a Dahaka, though, so I'll have to get two of them. Oh, no. Carax Beam. Not the Carax Beam. Ah, it's okay. It's fine. They're gonna really... All they're gonna achieve is push past mid a little bit. Uh, does he have extra health on these? Oh, he has a little bit of extra health and armor. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, as to why they survived. Come on, give me a void ray. I'm pressing X. Why am I pressing X? Oh my god, X is like slightly to the bottom. I was like, I have enough money. Where is it? X is also the hotkey for motherships, though. My brain is like, did you say motherships? Say no more. Put the finger on the X button. <laughs> Quite literally, X gonna give it to you. Oh my god, Nova just went for the explosions here. You know, those those will end up being very good against me. Um, is it time to transition into, uh, into motherships? You know, I, I, I think it might be. I mean, my death fleet's pretty strong right now as it stands. With that bonus damage here. That, I mean, ooh, yeah, because like, that AoE's gonna start chunking me down. Those Ravens are gonna be a problem eventually. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay, they're making their way downtown here into our base. They're making their way downtown. Gonna drop a scan here. Oh, yeah, he definitely has blood. He's regenerating pretty hard there. Um, does he have us? He has some extra armor on his phoenixes, and he's finally got some increased damage on them, so he can finally actually deal damage. Kind of. Not really. He dealt damage in our hearts. Um, there we go. Uh huh. Okay. Well, the thing is, the ravens are ridiculously bad against the tempest, though. So that's good. That is good. There we go. Let's put one of these that bad boys down here. I probably need some more havocs. I think I only have one havoc right now. I'm gonna get the squad site here, and uh, hope that helps out. The hawk has just got a bunch of ultras. He's got some ravasaurs here. Uh, thankfully, I can delete all of those with ease. Uh oh. Did the was that the nova? I think that was the Nova. The Nova left. I think he's out. Nova was out, dude. He built a bunch of ravens and he was like, nah, it's not gonna work. Okay, well, we're just gonna liquidate the cannon because, uh... Because that's our build here. Um... I mean, I could just buy some... I don't actually have the armor to take on motherships, though. Lamau, the Tempest made him rage quit, boys. Oh my god, Tempest enjoyment here. Coming in clutch. I'm gonna put down a second Havoc here. Three Havocs. Let's put down three more, like two more Havocs. Uh, yeah, there we go. Like the extra dummy thick Tempest. Yeah, he has double Earth, and I think he has... Oh, he has plus one range. What else is his last one? Oh, maybe he has like a cooldown reduction. There we go. And then like my Havoc there was just giving that range boost. Like there's no way Karax's units can actually like get through this. Karax just doesn't have fire. He has Earth, which is great for him. Unfortunately, Earth is terrible against Tempest because Tempest just do so much damage. Like the Earth doesn't matter, um, and the the Abathur wave is just gonna come right up here and just like slap everything. <clears throat> and then the Destroyers are here now. Oh yeah, baby! Destroyer splash, get them! Oh yeah, melt them! Melt them. Destroyers are actually killing the Creepers before they can get close. And that's it, boys. We're just gonna liquidate this thing. Woo! There we go, boys. Damn. I wish I could have had an opportunity to go vanguards, though. I think it's like, uh, the Hawk is, is someone you can't really do vanguards into because of his uh, insane splash damage. I don't know. I think I think it'll be. It, it's just more cost effective to uh, fly, you know? 
Uh, let's see, how much damage did I do? Oh wow, okay, I actually did the most on the team. I think it's probably the splash. I don't I don't think I killed the most on the team though, did I? No, I didn't. I definitely didn't. Artanis definitely was the one who was probably doing the killing. Yeah, there it is. Uh, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed the double fire void rays, be sure to leave a like. Uh, and tune in next time for some more aura shenanigans, because uh, this week is going to be the aura for auras week, so uh, stay tuned for more videos. If you guys are not yet subbed, <laughs> this is a wink wink nudge nudge to drop that sub. I'll see you guys later. The tires, let's light some fires! Need a light. They picked the wrong fight.